How you handle your pet's recovery from surgery is just as important as the surgery itself. We will now go through the six steps of post-operative care. If you have a feral or barn cat, please speak with a hospital team member and they will go through your instructions separately. Please keep your animals indoors in a warm, dry place with access to food and water. Animals recovering from an anesthetic can be unpredictable, so please keep small children away for 24 hours. We recommend that outdoor cats stay indoors for at least four days following surgery or complications such as bruising or incision breakdown may occur. Please check the incision daily. The incision should be clean, pink, and dry. You may notice some temporary bruising around the incision, but this should gradually improve over a week or so. All of the stitches are buried under the skin and will dissolve on their own. If you notice any swelling, discharge, or opening of the incision, please give us a call. You may notice a small green tattoo near the incision. This is the universal sign that your pet has been spayed or neutered. Do not allow your pet to lick or chew at the incision. A properly fitted e-collar is highly recommended for all animals and a must if you want to avoid incision complications. We recommend that they wear one for at least seven days. Despite looking silly, they can eat, sleep, and function normally in this collar. Please feed your pet a regular meal when you return home. Some animals will not be hungry tonight, but their appetite should return to normal tomorrow. Please avoid feeding any special treats or human food for seven to 10 days. All animals except feral and male cats will go home with at least two days of pain medication. The liquid medication is to be given once a day starting tomorrow morning. Just take the cap off the syringe and squirt it in their mouth. It's honey flavored, so most animals don't mind the taste. Strict rest for seven to 10 days will ensure that the incision has time to heal. Absolutely no walking, running, playing, baths, or swimming. Take dogs outside on a leash to use the bathroom. Try to keep cats from jumping off high surfaces. An overactive animal is prone to increased swelling, bruising, and incision breakdown. There is a no charge post-operative examination if you have any questions or concerns about the surgery. Post-operative complications can be treated in our medical clinic at a reduced cost during regular business hours. It is your responsibility to obtain emergency after hours treatment as required and all associated costs. Failure to follow these instructions can result in complications, including infection, incision breakdown, swelling, bruising, or bleeding.